All right, everybody. So we are unfortunately at the end. Let me share up this slide deck and see if this works as planned because we've been having technical issues today, haven't we? So uh, good news, we had zero incidents uh, and three warnings from the uh, security team. There were other warnings from moderators in chat, but nothing too major. So I think that's uh, pretty successful. Uh, so I'm excited. We also had record breaking 1,733 registration, uh, 462 students. Um, and out of that, we had 68 sponsors, 76 speakers and villages, and 132 staff and volunteers. We were able to give out more than 200 free tickets thanks to the people who gave like five, 10, 50 extra dollars when they bought their tickets, as well as DefendCon for sponsoring a chunk of those tickets. We had our badge workshop this year, which instead of having our solder maker village, we actually had five separate workshops to walk you through making your own badge from off the shelf parts. And there were awesome participants. I think everybody uh, managed to get through and get blinky bits at the end. Our lock picking workshop run by Lockpick Extreme had 40 enthusiastic and engaged participants that mostly all got through all the different locks that they had in their kits. Career Village had 34 one on one reviews and interviews, one live crowdsourced resume review. I'm intrigued. I missed this. <laughs> I wish I had seen this. And one live informal interview. There were hundreds of questions answered, and I know that channel was hopping the entire time. For our Capture the Flag competition sponsored by MongoDB, we had many participants and about 20 different prizes. Now, this is the part you all care about, right? So Daddy Coco Man, Bad Boy 17, and Kronos were the top three winners there with over 4,000 points in room each. So congratulations to the winning teams. Um, I believe the CTF team will be reaching out to you. If you don't hear anything, you can always DM us on Twitter and we will get you sorted out. Uh, so for those of you who were jamming out to the tunes and cracking through and finding all the flags, congratulations. I hope everybody enjoyed it. So we of course wanna thank all of our sponsors. Without them, we couldn't have had this platform, which although it's got some UI and UX issues and isn't quite intuitive, I do think it did work out. We were able to bounce between different stages, go to the different villages, hit the expo hall, do some networking. So we couldn't have afforded that being, you know, running our nonprofit and having this platform without them. You'd really be shocked how much it can be to run a virtual event uh, and if you think that's a lot, wait until you hear how much it takes to run our event in Vegas. So amid the uncertainty of COVID, they still took time and money out of their budgets to help us out. I specifically want to call out MongoDB, Microsoft, Salesforce, Verizon, Amazon Information Security, eLearn Security, Remediant, Intel, Thermo Fisher Scientific, Coinbase, and N8. So we had a bunch of raffles too. Um, everyone should be getting emails from me or have already gotten emails from me. These slides will be available later. So if you spot your name here, congratulations. And I will be reaching out to the email address on the ticket link and we will arrange how we get these to you. We've got exclusive TDI beach towels. There were only a certain number of these printed. We had some of them go to our keynotes, and then we are going to have some of them go as prizes. And other than that, you can't get them, limited edition. We have a clock kit, sparkle invaders, and an IoT weather camera system. We also have two tickets and workshop credits for B-Sides Orlando. eLearn Security sponsored four different course sets. So to those four winners, I hope you have some free time to learn. Uh, it's gonna be amazing. Wi-Fi Pineapple Tetras, thanks to Hack5, and gift cards, thanks to No Starch. 
we had our keynote winner. Uh, so we've got Bill and Nade. And if I mispronounce your name, I greatly apologize. And we've got uh, Gwen for this, the Pen Testers Blueprint, uh, Tribe of Hackers book, and a three months premium We Hack Purple subscription. So once again, tons of things to learn. I love that our society is always learning and sharing things with one another. If you haven't followed uh, a lot of these personalities on Twitter, they've got the Tribe of Hackers podcast and they're just constantly helping out and educating people just like in our amazing keynotes, like Kirsten was dropping all the knowledge bombs on us. So also if you wanna leave feedback about our speakers, go into Sketch. You don't need to make an account for Sketch. We've been having problems with that. If it prompts you, just ignore it. Uh, click on the talk that you're interested in and then click the feedback survey button. Um, if this becomes a problem, I'll just publish a link uh, in our Twitter to all of the talk uh, feedback links. Not the most elegant, but we'll do whatever it takes. Also, we wanna know how we did. What did you like? What did you not like? What ideas do you have for next year? We'll tweet it, we'll email it. Please take the time. The questions are all optional. So if you don't wanna answer one, just skip it. Also, uh, I really need to thank the community. We raised $15,000 in donations from individuals, which remember that whole multiple hundreds of tickets free? That's thanks to you. So you all support us and then we in turn try and support everybody that is a part of this community and needs that support. The free tickets went to people that were students, military veterans, people who were underemployed and unemployed. And of course, there wouldn't be a reason to show up uh, unless we had some things for you to do. So thank you to our keynotes and our speakers. It takes hours to prepare and hone in exactly what you're gonna say to put together your slides. And that is a lot of time and effort. And we deeply appreciate you taking the time to do that, to come here, to spend your Friday and Saturday with us and make sure that the community is learning all of the things that you know and just raising everybody up like that. It's amazing. And last, certainly not least, the hundreds of volunteer squad we've got. Um, we put out the call, everyone answered it. It was a bit chaotic, but there were over a hundred friendly people who donated their time to bounce around, answer your questions, hang out on social media, review your resumes. So if you know anyone who volunteers at any conference, give them a hand. Finally, I got a couple more things, and this one I really hope sticks with you. Our slogan this year was breaking boundaries bite by bite. Boundaries can come in many forms, self-imposed and those imposed by your company, even those imposed by your society. When faced with problems, it can seem daunting. The most common advice is to pick one specific area of a problem and go after that. Take that bite, break it, and then go to the next. Remember, it only takes a bite to overflow a buffer we can break the systems that are stopping us. This year, many of us face a host of different boundaries, problems, and systemic issues. I hope that at this event, you were able to make some friends who in the future could be part of your support network and find the tools and skills to raise up yourself and raise up others. And since we're normally located in Las Vegas, I am going to make a specific call out to my peers in the United States, even though I'm currently in Canada. Diana Initiative stands firm with all of our brothers and sisters, black, brown, trans, queer, non-binary, and all underserved communities. This year is exposed to the masses, the trauma you have all been systematically experiencing for generations. You've been breaking boundaries bite by bite and laying the road to equality before us. You matter, and we hope to partner with all of you in building not just equality, but equity within our industry. So we do hope to see you next year. It's going to be on August 5th and 6th, 2021. Circumstances willing, once again at the Westin Hotel in Las Vegas. No casino and no smoking. And uh, we do have a final raffle draw, which I did 
right before I came up on here. And then don't forget to go in the reception area. There's free swag and discount. So edit, copy, edit, paste them into a notepad file. Uh, we might also email it out to the attendees. And of course, join us afterwards in the networking area for the social hour. So Karen, you won Pentester's Blueprint, three months premium subscription to We Hack Purple, and your choice of any of the four Tribe of Hackers books. Thank you, everybody. And I hope you have a great rest of the event.